So, um, I was going to see the Total Recall remake. I'm still going to later today. Um, and I was like, I should probably see the original first of Arnold Schwarzenegger. I checked to see if it was on TV last night, and it was in the middle of the night, so I recorded it, DVR, went to sleep, woke up and watched it, and just finished it, and I enjoyed it. It was um, pretty good. I mean, you know, it's a early, it's a late, it's an early 90s um, kind of B-movie, I guess you'd say. It's, you know, it's not a Schwarzenegger action B-movie, I mean, it's just good fun, you know? I mean, you're not supposed to get seriously just to grab some popcorn and have a good time. Um, you know, it's a, it's a B-popcorn movie. I mean, I mean, you pretty much know right away when you see Arnold Schwarzenegger on the cover. <laughs> um, and the remake, um, is, uh, well, the reboot, um, supposedly has Colin Farrell in it, and he's a good actor, um, so I'm sure the reboot will be good, I'm gonna see it later today, but, um, the original is pretty good, I'm sure, um, I'm sure the reboot will probably be just as good, because it's a B-action reboot, I mean, a reboot takes the same basic premise and changes the story, so I'm sure, I mean, the reboot will be, I mean, same, you know, um, memory kind of storyline, but different kind of thing that's going on. So it's almost like a completely different movie, but, but with the same kind of, um, architecture, I guess you could say. So, it's basically a new story, but the same total recall premise. So I'm sure the reboot with Colin Farrell, right after, will be very good. Um, will it be good as the unfortunate version? It might be. Fall on, fall on, it could be better, but I don't know. Um... So Total Recall on Schwarzenegger is a really good movie, you should definitely check it out. And um, the remake is out in theaters right now, so if you're um, looking for something to do, see if the, re see if the original is on TV. Um, apparently this was like the last um, TV screening for like a while or something, um, it said, so I'm lucky. So I actually saw it for only eight dollars um, on Blu-ray on Amazon. Um, so you could just buy it on Amazon. Usually, when I buy movies stuff on Amazon, it takes like two days. So you could just um, I'd buy it for eight dollars on Blu-ray. Um, wait two days, watch it, and then go see the reboot of Colin Farrell. That's a good idea. So I'm gonna see the reboot today. I will have a review for it. And yeah. Stay tuned for my review of the reboot.